in your business about a good manager will address the conflict and get everything resolved so everybody can come to agreement and a bad manager will pull everybody to the side one by one and say bad things to the next employee and never get the situation resolved. You get the inventory stuff done? Well, I told Chris I'm to do that. But I assigned it to you. Well, I was trying to, you know, had two things going on at one time, so I was trying to, you know. What, right? Twitter? Nah, man. Bro, you always on your phone, though. How you say you got two things going at once? I don't get that. That's hilarious to me. Well, I don't mean it. You know, like I said, I let that on him. You know what I mean? Bro, I don't even use the gym. Can y'all please step in my office so we can talk about this? So I do. What's man. going on? So you and Antimon, how you got arguing right in my office? Yeah, like, I assigned him an inventory job to make sure everything was right, and he stays on his phone and I just got on to him. Okay, Antoine. You know inventory plays a big role in our corporation next time, Key. You make sure inventory get done right. Yeah, I got you. Okay, can y'all stand up and shake hands? So, all right, man. Come to agree. Antoine, can I see your mouth? Don't worry about it. I'm going to get on to him. I said, I'm going to camera out until I'm on the phone. I see you trying to, you know, get the door Yeah. Right. I'll get him square away. All right, please do. So I see y'all uh, getting to it or whatever. Don't worry about it. I see your camera all the time. Uh, I see you being a He's not enforcing rules. Yeah. Uh, just go back to work doing what you're going to do. Here, can be all right? All right. To fire someone in your business environment to let them know what they did wrong and the reason to let them go. Any bad ways to call them before they shift and tell them not to come in and you will tell them to come back. How you doing, Mr. Cobb? Um, I got you in my office today because uh, your uh, lack of work has not been good. I gave you in the morning and you still have to come to work late. And with this type of business, we can have it, so they say I'm happy to let you go. But, uh, you know, can you uh, sign this uh, termination paper before you leave? How you doing, Mr. Mosley? Yeah, man. Uh, I was just kind of let you know that uh, I took you off the schedule for the week, so you don't have to come in. And uh, I will call you whenever I need you. Yes, yes, sir. I mean, uh, I, I have I have a lot of people on the schedule, and right now I don't need you. I understand that, sir, but uh, I'll just call you when I need you. Man, uh, okay. fire. Uh, I'm not firing you. It just, uh, I just don't need you. I'll just call you when I need you. Man, uh, uh, man, uh. Okay. Good manager, when he see employee do wrong, he will correct the mistakes and show him the right thing to do. And a bad manager, he will continue to badge the employee and threaten him, saying that's why he won't. Man, what y'all doing, man? I thought y'all supposed to block the exit, though, man. We're doing business, no way. 
Man, we didn't even use this door. But still, you know, you're not the block there, man. Boy, y'all some idiots, man. You know, stupid, man. You don't know how to do that. Man, come on, come on this damn table. I don't try to hear this man mouth.